Here are five unsettling mysteries and unsolved cases from around the world that I found on the web. The Veliska Axe Murders On June 10, 1912, minus one people, including six children, were brutally murdered with an axe in their home in Veliska, Iowa. The killer had entered the house at night while the family and two guests were sleeping and had bludgeoned them to death with an axe that belonged to the father, Josiah Moore. The killer also covered the windows and mirrors and left a plate of uneaten food and a bowl of bloody water in the kitchen. The police investigated several suspects, but none of them were convicted. The motive and identity of the killer remain unknown. The Jack the Ripper Murders In the autumn of 1888, a serial killer known as Jack the Ripper terrorized the White Capel District of London. He targeted female prostitutes and killed them by slashing their throats and mutilating their abdomens. He also sent letters to the police and the press, claiming to be the murderer and mocking their efforts to catch him. The police investigated several suspects, but none of them were conclusively linked to the crimes. The identity and motive of Jack the Ripper remain a mystery, and he is considered one of the most notorious and elusive serial killers in history. The Diet Love Pass Incident In February 1959, nine experienced hikers died under mysterious circumstances while camping in the Ural Mountains of Russia. Their bodies were found scattered around their tent, which had been cut open from the inside. Some of the hikers had severe injuries, such as fractured skulls and chest trauma, while others had only minor bruises. Some were also partially in rest, or missing clothing and shoes. The official Soviet investigation concluded that the hikers died of hypothermia due to an unknown compelling force. Various theories have been proposed to explain the incident, such as an avalanche, a military test, a paranormal phenomenon, or an attack by a Yeti. The Springfield Three On June 7, 1992, three women, Cheryl Levitt, her daughter, Suzy Streeter, and her friend, Stacy McCall, disappeared from Levitt's home in Springfield, Missouri. They had last been seen at a graduation party the night before and had planned to spend the night at Levitt's house. The next morning, their friends and family found the house unlocked with the women's personal belongings, cars and dog, left behind. There was no sign of a struggle or a break-in, and the only clue was a strange message on the answering machine, which was later erased by the police. The case remains unsolved, and the fate of the Springfield Three is unknown. The Boy in the Box On February 25, 1957, the body of a young boy was discovered in a cardboard box in a wooded area of Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. He was estimated to be between four and six years old and had been severely malnourished and abused. He had also been recently washed and groomed, suggesting that someone had cared for him before or after his death. Despite extensive publicity and investigation, no one ever came forward to claim or identify the boy. He was buried in a potter's field with a simple gravestone that read, Heavenly Father, bless this unknown boy. His case is still open and active and is considered one of the most baffling unsolved murders in American history. 